here we are. Um, this is not my local Dollar Tree, but we're gonna go see what this one is like. Oh, I like the lights up there. Here we go. Excuse me. Hi, how are you doing? Good, how are you doing? I'm great, thank you for asking. See some pretty stuff right off the bat. Wow. I like these. That's different. Maybe they've had them and I just hadn't seen them. Oh, look at all the drink cups. Those are cool. Wow. <laughs> I haven't seen the flamingos. Uh -huh. Boy, those are like little flowers. Maybe Maybe little daisies. I have all the ice cream cups. I've seen a lot of those. There's the watermelon ones. That's pretty cool. Good. Oh, this is nice. Everything's fine, and there's sunshine. That's adorable. Okay, and then over here, oh look, they got a whole different selection of flip flops. Those are nice, I'm kind of tempted. Let's see, I really like these. But they're kind of thin. All flip flops are thin though. No. That's a nice pattern too. And that's big, like bigger than my foot, thank goodness. But they got some, that, that's cute. I haven't seen anything like that. I've seen lemon ones somewhere that I liked, but I haven't seen that one. That's cute. I wonder if that would hurt in between my toes. I'm kind of sensitive about that. I don't know. I haven't seen this one. This one's cute. There's the butterfly one. There's the turtle. State of mind, but I have not seen. I'm almost too short. This one, I like this one. I think I'm gonna have to get that one because I haven't seen it and it's cute. Spring fling, summer fun. So they got all the summer stuff out, badmintons and bubbles, bug catcher thingies. I love these, these are little swim, outdoor fun things. This is a splash and swim, this is a splash and swim. There's Dory. There's Nemo again. Whoops. Here I go, knocking stuff down already. Put it back. Oh, look, they have the. Uh, I haven't seen these. That's cute. Star plates. And I guess they have gold instead of white, red, white, and blue. So. And the rest of it, I think I've seen. I picked up a bunch of it. Um, they got the grilling stuff next to the 4th of July memorial stuff makes sense. So, because people are going to be grilling. Hmm. All right. Hmm, they're starting to put out dad stuff for fourth for dad, not fourth for dad's day. That's cute. Dad's workshop. <laughs> Is if it isn't broken, don't fix it. Go ask your mother when in doubt. Use duct tape. That's so funny. This one says Dad's workshop, my tools, my rules. Is there another one? Dad's garage, always open. Dad's fishing rules. Those are cute. I don't know. I'll get that back in there. And then they got the little dad's balloons. Um, socks. Don't see ties. more outdoor toys for the summertime goggles oh this is interesting flying water disc oh it's soft it's squishy even oh that'd make a big splat at you and there's the sprayers bug catchers left and right oh there's some jump ropes and there's lots of balls and different catchers and things like that and these are uh, kites 
There's uh, LOL, there's Spider-Man, Paw Patrol, and that one's, uh, oh, that's from um, Minecraft. So, very cool. Alright. I think these are the widest aisles I've ever been down. Look how wide this aisle is. I'm used to being cramped. Oh, look at these. These are cute. Now, they're for birthday, but you could use them probably for any holiday you want to. Got a lot of assorted cups. There's some Minions and Star Wars and Mandalorian and all kinds of cups and stuff. Mm -hmm. Celebrate. And then we have bags and boxes and I, I buy those boxes they're really cute for gift giving um, more toys different toys okay and over here we're gonna start going wow these are some wide aisles so I'm in the book section and we're gonna check it out they got a lot of nice books it looks like a lot of books stuff put together the lost puzzler War Maidens, wow, Lies of Descent, oh lord, that looks crazy good, um, some I've seen, now I keep running into this, and I keep trying to decide if I'm going to get it or not, it's Macbeth by Shakespeare, and I know at some point my daughter's going to have to read it, but for $1.25, that might be worth having, though it is paperback, and it's small, and the print is kind of tiny, it still might be worth having, but wow, look at Life with the Father. So, I like to poke in the books because sometimes they have, there's a whole Nancy Drew collection for that age group. They sometimes have some really interesting books that Awakening. They have cookbooks. Wow, there's so many. Stronger Than You Know, that sounds like a good book. Wow what it takes well, that looks interesting and ominous at the same time right um, the summer deal Bethlehem the lightness the lightness the boy in the field there again. the devil you know interesting flashcards Alright, and then there's some more breakfast, I mean cookbooks, not just breakfast, but they have cook cooking for kids made simple. Hmm. Alright, I'm going to go down here and look for some of the adult coloring books. These, This is not adult, but those are Star Wars, which is kind of cool. Um, and let's see, not seeing any. Maybe the store doesn't care. Yes. Or maybe I'm just not looking low enough. First rule of Dollar Tree look high and low because stuff is everywhere. They have shelves everywhere. Oh, these are really cool. I haven't seen this many colors of these. I've seen people asking about these little caddies and what you can use for them. But look how nice colors. That's like yellow green, pink, dark pink, light pink, lavender. That's cool. I wonder what this actually is oh it is an activity tray <laughs> and a lot of different colors and then they have these they're like a book box I didn't know what a book box was when my daughter started having to get those shame to say that oh let me get this out of the way all right let's see all right Yes, all right, that's cute. Look at this little bit. Get up with the baby. That that's adorable. A lots of different toys, bathrooms. All right, hang on. So I don't have a need for them, but they have a Dollar Tree Plus, and excuse me, they have these big old bins. This would be good in a um, pantry for potatoes or something like that. Looks adjustable. Um, they got. The wide belts from the 80s over here. And here is their Dollar Tree Plus. We got some kids' fun stuff. That looks pretty cool. Some towels. Oh, look, they got the 4th of July or the Star Stripes socks for $3. 
I wonder if those are, yeah, they're ladies. And they have a tie-dye bike short. I don't like that one in the front. That one's cute. I like that one. That's a medium. That's $5. You get one pair for $5. I don't know if that's worth it. There's a large. I don't think I could do a large. I think it needs to be bigger for me. I don't want to fall off, but I don't want to buy me either. either. Alright. So, over there is all the organization stuff. And they have the folding. They have a couple of these. They're really nice. I like them. Oh, look at this. Although I'm not a dog person, I do like that. I mean, I have had dogs. I like dogs. I just, I don't know. I'm a, more of a cat person. So, let's see what else they got. Oh, they got these cute little fans now. I saw these the other day. It's a little big, but it's a personal fan you can cool yourself with. Um, I don't know. Does it take batteries? How does this work? Um, powerful and safe, large opening. Hmm. I don't see it. Let's see, put the water in. Do not freeze. Yeah, it takes batteries. So, that's okay though. So, I did find some new decor. This one's grateful. This one's blessed. Uh, oh, yep, there's another one. There's thankful. And these are heavy. And I don't know what that else that's made of. They are $5 a piece, but those are nice and they're heavy. And as you can see right here, I'm going to be careful, but this one's already broken. It's cracked. But they are nice. These are very cute. I'm trying to show folks what. Dollar Tree Plus looks like because not everybody has one. Here's um, bath. It's in the kitchen where warmth and laughter and life create a recipe that spans generations. These are coarse decor. And that one just says welcome. But the cool thing about it is this is three pieces. You get that sign. But if you look closely, there's two little signs. That come with it they're on this side I have seen this one before I've not seen these before and they have the three pieces to them as well so there's the bath one yeah those are those are really cute and let's see they're five dollars a piece they have some fountains for the five dollars um I don't think I've seen that before but might just be where it's located in the store. Oh, our family is blessed. That's nice. Let's not drop everything. I think that's the only two I'm seeing. Yeah. But that's cute. This is cute. It says hello. And it's $3. That one says hello. That one says relax. These are cute. This looks a little trash can. Oh my God, totally, no limit, shine bright, shoot for the moon, good vibes only, and dream big. That one is $3. And we have some candles. I've smelled these before, they're kind of cute. They're heavy, that's for sure. And then we have some lunch boxes up there. And then we have some car kit stuff. So, condiment holder, tire gauge, folding desk mount. Here's one that you can clip into your air vent. There's the seat belt pads. I've seen those. There's a bling one. I've not seen that one. So, it's a seat belt pad like this, except it's got bling bling on it. So, it's shiny. See? Right across her shoulder there. That's interesting. Uh, not something I'm going to probably do, but cute. Uh, oh, nice little waste basket. Sometimes hard to find ones that are tall but narrow. That's pretty good. Let's see how much is, is this. Doesn't look like it has a price on it. But it's either three or five because it's in the three or five section. So, all right.
Let's see. I've already bought this. It's only three dollars, and that's a lot for three bucks. So, and then look at this. This is new. I haven't seen that. That's forty. No, that's fifty-six fluid ounces for five bucks. Hmm. It's not a bad idea. Oh, there's Rainex. I have not seen Rainex here before for three dollars. I've seen the Otoban and the Zip Clorox. Clorox paper towel wipes. Oh, yeah. So, and then here's some more trash bags. Oh, look at their shirts. They're all nice and neat. Oh, my word. This is organized over here. This is lovely. Wow. Lilo and Stitch, the villains, and Orion. I was looking to see if they had any Star Wars, but I don't see any. But they're all nice and neat, pretty much. What is that one? Oh, Akuna Matata. Huh, I forget what movie Akuna Matata. There's the only Star Wars shirt I see. Oh, and it's an extra large. How about that? Hmm. I wonder. Excuse me. Sorry, baby. Let's see. We'll put that right there. All right. They're electronics. And wow, they got a lot of organizational stuff. And some more toys. These are a little more expensive. Look at those puzzles. They look very intimidating. I mean, look at that. That's <laughs> four puzzles in one set, but the puzzles themselves have to be. That's very hard to do. Look at that balloon. That's just. I don't know if I could get that done. So. Here's some really cute little play sets. My daughter's had this one when she was littler, and this one when she was younger, and really enjoyed playing with them. They're really cute. And look, they have these little fake bobble tees. And actually, she has an orange. Look, see, it's one back there. It's orange. She got one of these. It's just a little squishy thing. But they're a lot of fun to mess with. Uh, set of balls. That's cool for five bucks. And some darts and some games. Yeah, not bad. Um, that's interesting. Don't want that in my house. Nope. Not scared of spiders. Not at all. Don't want it in my house. Not even the fake ones. Not interested at all. Toilet tissue and paper and stuff. Oh, I might have to come back down that aisle. They look like they're putting stuff out. Oh, wait. I want to go right here and look. Oh. Look at all the pretties candles. I have a ton of candles, but they have some nice ones here. Candle holders. Look at that. Oh. That's different. That's different. So I just saw this real quick. There's no place like bed. Yep. So let's check something here. This is their baby powder. It does not look like it has any talc in it. Yay! Alright, back over here. I was looking for, I love these. These are so cute. Look at that shine on that. Changing colors. You couldn't go wrong with any of these. Um, let's look down low. Yeah, I'm not seeing the candles that I was hoping to find. Maybe not seeing them but that's okay that's okay they have a lot just not the ones I'm looking for okay those little sachets that go in your drawers I love them got to, oh well here near the socks on the other side mm -hmm. okay I have not seen these before hair and lip set. This one's Trolls. Here's a, a JoJo. And here is an LOL. That's very cute. Had not seen those yet. So. And then they have the butterfly clips. Little succinct thingies. Okay, I just took a deep sigh. <gasps> you didn't get to hear it because I paused for a second. But look, I found it. So. These are the new hyaluronic 
acid hydrating body lotions. There's three different ones. There's the green one, the vitamin C. The green one is hyaluronic. This one is the vitamin C, and this one is the collagen. So, and I'm checking to make sure it has the lid cover on it, and it does. Make sure it has the plastic around it. All right, and we'll grab one of each. Okay, so they have this right here, tea tree oil and salicylic acid balancing face wash. So this would be really good for you because it's still, if you have like acne or pimples because it's, the salicylic acid is really good for that. It says it's um, phthalates free, sulfate free, paraben free, silicone free, oil free. So that's really nice to hear. And here are some of the ingredients. I'm going to make sure there's nothing really crazy in that. It doesn't look like there's anything crazy. Witch hazel, that's also very good for you. Wow, that looks like that would be very good for you if you have any kind of acne problems. So, And they've got a ton of them here. And they have some really interesting eyelashes. Eyelash kit slay. It's blue. And this one is um, girl boss with the purple. Wow, and it looks like they got another one back there. It's silver. Yeah, they have a lot, and they are crazy. I have not delved into wearing false eyelashes. I want to try them just so I know what it's like, but I don't think I'll ever be a long-term user or wearer of them. But eh, I don't know. We'll just see. But I don't know. I don't think I could pull that off. <laughs> So sometimes to find the little toothbrushes that you can use without water, you have to look in the hanging section. I've seen them in boxes on the shelves in the travel section, and now here, this is the second Dollar Tree, I've seen them in the hanging section. By the way, they do have sensitive toothpaste for those who have sensitive teeth. So there's the vitamin C. I'm also looking for, I think I'm gonna get this. I've, I've seen it a few times. And I have not got it, but for a dollar twenty-five, I think I want to give one a try. It's a seven-day pill organizer, so that looks kind of interesting. Um, also, if they have more of the little ones of the hand sanitizer, um, that have the words on it. So this one says blissful. This one says vibrant, and I think there's one called peace. Yeah, peaceful. There it is. They're really cute. Still hand sanitizer. You could refill the bottles. They have these chap ices. This is cute. Lip balm. I think I might get a set of this for um, a little gift bag I'm putting together. Alright, let's keep on going. So I had to stop and head to the restroom for a minute. And on my way back, I see these. These are cute. They're BPA free. They're a dollar and a quarter. They're pink and blue and gray. And I think there's a green one back there. Yes, there's a green one right there. So I don't know how great they do, but it's pretty good. I mean, who doesn't always need another water bottle, right? My daughter goes to them like she's eating candy or something. I don't know. Um, oh, these are cute too. I've seen these before. These are uh, dishwasher magnets. I guess you could use them excuse me for something else that one's just clean and dirty someone wash me and on the back what does it say someone empty me those are cute I don't think I need another one I already have not one of these but a different one and then they have these ponchos right here look these are great for travel because like if you're at one of the theme parks or something they charge you like nine bucks for one of these things and it's just plastic you end up throwing away so Speaking of plastic, they have straws here. This is longer flex. I've seen these before. Um, uh, they don't say BPA free or anything like that, so they're probably not. So just be aware of that. I can't believe we still have foam cups because I thought foam was bad for us. But anyway, it's still around. Alright, so we will go this way. 
I was at a Dollar Tree and I bought a square, a rectangular scrubby, kind of like this, but not this. This is not as scruffy as this looks, and it was scruffy, and I love the thing, and of course now I can't find another one. Should have bought more than one. That's the first rule. If you like it, you probably should get more than one. Um, and these are just not as scruffy. Now, I have bought another one of these, or bought one of these to try one of these. Actually, I bought this one. Um, I'm not sure. I haven't even opened it yet. I got to see if that's scruffy enough because I want exfoliating. And that's coconut infused. I don't know if I want infused with anything. These are great. I keep this in my, my bed and I put my glasses and a cloth, cleaning cloth, um, remote controls, and lotion in mine. And then I can just pick it up and move it real easy. I don't have to bother grabbing all of those things. So. Let's see what else we got going on. Lots of hair brushes. There's a beard trimming cape. I've been thinking about getting that for my husband because he makes such a mess when he trims his beard. Does everybody do that? I mean, it's, what do you do with the hair? You put it down the sink? No, because it clogs the sink. Does it go down the garbage? Well, yeah, but then if you're not careful, it'll stroll everywhere and then you have to vacuum. And he has to shave pretty often, so. All right, I'm gonna poke around. You gotta look in these things because sometimes they'll say what they are and they're not true. Like this one. Oh, that's cool. These are these little ironer patches. It's not Pantene. It's not conditioner, and there's no conditioner in there. Shampoo, no conditioner. Shave prep, no, that's shampoo. Baby wipes, no, that's. Is that the conditioner? No, that's shampoo. So you have to read and look because might not be the same so these little travel kits are kind of cool I mean it's got a place it's got a little container for like some um, face cream and it's got the, the little covered for your toothbrush and then a couple of you know, shampoo conditioner or soap whatever and a body scrub that's a good deal for a dollar and a quarter shower travel kit is what it's called and we got a bunch of them I think there was some on the end cap down there too just trying to see what else this might be in that box so all right and keep going now I've seen the dove of this and now here's the ponds of this just a little cream this is great to keep next to your bed in case you need it here's one thing that I grabbed this liquid skin to put in like an emergency kit because it's like a band-aid but better because it really doesn't have to stick like that, like a band-aid would come off, and this is really helpful to have. Um, they're getting more and more men's stuff, so we have this Hydra Cream face, hand, and body for men. Uh, I guess women could use it too, but it, it's marketed for men. It's the right dark color. Here's more of those little shower travel pouches I was talking about. That's a really good deal, actually. We got white or clear and blue for the men and they have a whole bunch of them uh, do, do, do. I have a set of travel stuff so I'm not gonna buy that but if I didn't I would definitely pick that up um, foot powder spray and is this the is this I have a hard time finding conditioner in these little packets there it is I just said I have a hard time finding conditioner and there it is so it's Pantene. I wonder, can you mix? I guess you can mix whether you have um, Pantene or White Rain or whatever. I guess your um, doesn't matter if your conditioner and your shampoo mat match or not. So <laughs> I'm not seeing these Spa Luxury Cherry Blossom and Peach scent. I'm gonna smell this right now because I love Cherry Blossom usually, but. But not all cherry blossom is good. That one is pretty good. That's pretty that's pretty good actually. And they have another one called Wonder. And this one is vanilla cashmere. Let's smell that one. That looks new to me. Mm, that's pretty nice. Um, and then they have this acne scrub deep cleansing. Oh yeah, no problem. Move it at your way. I'm sorry. It's all good. I haven't seen this. It's a rose gold sheet mask. This one says soothing. And 
This one is just regular gold. And do we have more? Yep, there's a silver one that says purifying. Those are interesting. We're making a, a little basket for somebody. Soothing. I might get that for a basket I'm making for somebody. She's not a girly girl, but hey, maybe we can turn her into one. All right. Let's see those. All right. Okay, I know I've been seeing some of the press on nails and now I see them here in person. So here's some uh, that is black with the gold glitter. That's cute. I think that's the only color that they have out right now. But I have not seen that one. The one that I've been seeing online was like a pink color. Not seen the black with the glitter gold. That's pretty cool. Speaking of such, it's not glitter gold, but look at that. I mean, if you're not buying nail polish, but that's wet and wild. And that's pretty. That's very pretty. It's called Sparked. Wild Shine. And then they have one without the glittery in it. That's called Red Red. That does not look red to me, though. That looks... I don't know if you picked that up on the camera, but that looks more... I don't know. Um, wine? Not a red color, but it got pink in it. So, and then here's some more of the press ones look like gel. All right, moving along. So here's some more electronic stuff. Now these are $5, you have to pay attention to the price because sometimes it does change depending on where you are, especially if it's in a store with the plus, right? But they have some cool little gadgets. This is uh, a LED headphone stand. Um, this is a mouse that lights up that's kind of cool. There's some speakers. This is a, a puck string of lights with a remote control so you can like put this wherever you want. They have some AirPods, some more. There's some back there, Ariel. And here's a light bar and some charging. See, that's two kinds of cables. Excuse me, cables that can hook up. And a battery box. So let's keep going. I'm gonna go down to snacks. So they do have my sesame crisps that I really like. There is a warning at the bottom that tells you that you need to go to this website and check it out. And it's because this does have natural flavors in it. And natural flavors can be a lot of different things. So there's some... The jury's still out on whether that causes any harm or not. But it's in a lot of foods and stuff. So uh, we do need to be careful. But everybody has to make their own choice and decision about these. I have a bunch at home. And I am going to still eat them because I do think that they're fine. But everybody has to make their own choice. Yeah. If you look at what's in the food, whether it's sold here or somewhere else, um, there's a lot of things that we should probably take under consideration before consuming. And especially giving to our children. Not just the sugar and the natural stuff, but there's some other stuff in there that might not be the best for us. So we all have to kind of look and see. But wow, this is the first Dollar Tree I've been at that I've seen IBC. I love IBC. But this is not diet. So, and this is the cream soda. So I really can't, or shouldn't consume it. I can, I'm choosing not to. So, but for no other reason than it's not diet. But they have a lot of choices here. It's amazing to me how much choice. Oh my sweet Lord. Their freezer section is packed. Wow, I've never been to a Dollar Tree that had so much stuff in the freezer section. Look at all of that. Holy Toledo, those are Sunday cups. And this is $1.25. And they have ices and sour patches and oh, here's pizzas and there's some pot pies. I stay away from those. They run my blood sugar high. But good gravy oh look at that jalapeno poppers sandwiches and it's not homemade stuff but over here they have vegetables which is awesome frozen veggies are pretty good depends on how you prep it I guess. And let's see do they have my pickles 
Oh, they have my oh snap pickles, but I'm gonna say oh snap because I can tell you right now they do not have my ones because those are the, the hot ones, the hottie bites, and those right there are the dilly bites. And I like the sassy bites because they're not spicy and those hottie bites are too hot for me. But look, they have Sunny D. I wish they had Diet Sunny D, but they don't. They have a lot of fruit cups, butter. Wow. This is a very well stocked freezer section. Okay, so I'm going to move on. So this is funny. This is the bath uh, cleaner refills. See? And it says refills right there. And it's three in the count. The bottle that this goes with, the spray bottle, is not here. I know this because I found the spray bottle and these at another Dollar Tree. And then I found the spray bottle without the refills at another Dollar Tree. So sometimes you find the bottle at one Dollar Tree, the refills at another Dollar Tree, and it's rare if you can find them both at the same place. But they do exist, and it is out there. The bottle for it looks kind of like this except it has um, a square a square cardboard box on the top of it with two of the pods in there and it tells you that it is bathroom cleaner so I don't see that here I don't see it high and I don't see it low but it could be just down the way a little but I'm not seeing it again I'm loving this Dollar Tree because it's the, the aisles are so wide and because it's clean and neat and organized I mean look even by the cash registers that's some crazy mess right there because like most Dollar Trees I go to, sometimes it looks like a tornado hit it. <clears throat> and it's not their fault. They try to do the best they can, but I've seen kids go in there and tear them up and stuff. Now, I've just bought some of these recently. This is a good day to have a great day. And then together, family love. And then this one says four paws, love, four paws. And there's grateful. And I think there's a blessed one of those. But it's probably down in there, and I don't really want to dig through all of them. Oh, there it is. Blessed grateful. I don't think there's another one. Yeah, they're the same. So I bought a set of those uh, to put in a basket for somebody. Oh, because they're nice little things to have. I also bought two of these spoon wrists. They have a black one down there, a gray one, a white one, a red one. I bought the red one for myself as well for the, the holidays for Memorial Day, Fourth of July and stuff. So, but if you're starting out a new house, this is a uh, good place to find kitchen gadgets on a dime so you can maybe upgrade or figure out what you want so as we all have those little things that we need I'm just checking out the end caps here because sometimes you find oh look at this it says let your light shine is that a planner or is it just a notebook it is a planner and it says monthly goals tracker well there's your meal tracker grocery list measurements I don't think I would put it in a permanent bound book like that but for some people that might work out real nice yeah. lots of jerky these are luggage tags and I like the colorful ones because when you put them on your luggage you'll know it's yours when it comes off that turnstile um, I have a ton of reading glasses. I found some folding ones that I like. Yes, folding, like this one right here. And they do fold nicely and unfold. They come in different powers and different styles. Pretty nice to have. Okay, let's move on. So this is the food aisle. I got, dang, I got so much stuff. Just everything is, wow, there's no holes. It's just... I love bugles. I love bugles. Love me some bugles. There's Chester Cheetah here. Wow. That's a lot of good stuff. A lot of condiments, pastas, mac and cheese. My girl is stuck in the mac and cheese phase, unfortunately. Pardon me, dear. Wow. We're done. Okay, these probably should have been up front, but look at that. Isn't that cute? And what else we got? Oh, there's a pineapple one. Those are cute. And there's a whole stack and underneath there it says Happy Holidays. Look at that. Okay, I need to put something down because I want to look at those. 
I'll move those back in a minute. That's for Christmas, but look at that. That's really cute. For a dollar going down. What else they got under there hiding? That's a blue checky. And then there's the these again. And then down here, look at that. Looks like a surfboard or something. And then they got the chargers. There's a watermelon one. So if you go through and you might find something else. That's adorable. Let's check it out all the glasses. They have such a ton of glasses. Like these margaritas. This is real glass. This is very heavy. Like these. It's really cute. Got some new ones. Haven't seen before. Here are the cups I just bought. Some of these. I bought this one. I bought this one. I bought that one. I just bought a bunch to have. So I don't think people like my cups that I have that came with my set. Oh, okay. So they have it here in the food aisle. But this right here, this was a really good find of mine. So here it's a dollar twenty-five for seven point two five ounces. And online, one of these goes for like $5.24, or you can get two for $8 and something, like 35 cents. This has a lot of different uses. You can use it for cleaning, cooking, and for skincare, hair care, believe it or not. And these don't expire until 2024. I've seen some that don't expire until 2025, right there. And I'm gonna prove this. 